नमस्कार पॉजिटिव भारत सहित तो मपूर्व प्रथम हेडलाइंस ओलंपिक्स परे पारा ओलंपियांस को उत्साहित कले प्रधानमंत्री भिस्रे खिलाड़ी को मोदी को विजय मंत्र 24 रु टोक्यो रे टक्कर 9 विभाग रे भारत रो 54 खिलाड़ी अफगानिस्तान रु भारत फेरिले भारतीय 120 जन को नै जामनगर पहुचिला वायुसेना रो C17 एयरक्राफ्ट सबड अमेरिका प्रतिपक्षन को कथा हेले विदेश मंत्री एस जयशंकर अफगान रे फसीथिबा भारतीय अंक सुरक्षा दायित्व हातो कुनेले अजीत डोभाल अफगानिस्तान संकट भितरे भिसा नीति रे परिवर्तन करले भारत सरकार जारी हेला जरूरी कालीन ई भिसा व्यवस्था ऑनलाइन रे करी हेबा आवेदन गृह मंत्रालय पक्षर घोषणा प्रधानमंत्री आवास योजना रे 16488 टी घर निर्माण पय अनुमोदन ए पर्यंत मोट 1 कोटी 13 लाख गृह निर्माण पय मंजूरी 85.65 लाख घर निर्माण अधीन रहितबा बेले 51 लाख रु अधिक घर काम शेष भुवनेश्वर रे भारतीय हॉकी टीम खेलाडी को स्वागत रे प्रकंपित हेला पूरा शहर ओडिसा को प्रशंसा सह घर भली अनुभव हेउछि बोली कहले रानी रामपाल लोकसभा भवन रे खेलाडी को सम्मानित करिवे राज्य सरकार देखबा संपूर्ण खबर टोकियो पैरालंपिक्स पय जाउतवा एथलेट्स को सहित कथा आले प्रधानमंत्री नरेंद्र मोदी आज दिन 11टा रे वीडियो कॉन्फ्रेंसिंग माध्यम रे प्रधानमंत्री पारा एथलेट मानक सहित कथा होचंते अगस्त 24 रु सेप्टेंबर 5 मधरे टोकियो रे अनुष्ठित हेबो पैरालंपिक्स गेम्स नौटि विभाग रे भारत रो प्रतिनिधित्व करिवे 54 जण पारा एथलेट चलित पैरालंपिक्स रे मध्य भारत अधिक पदक जितिबा नै आशा रहछ तालिबानी आतंकवादी को कब्जा रे पूरा देश आतंक रे देश छाडु छंती अफगानिस्तानी यहारी मध्ये रे युद्ध एवं हिंसा रे अंत करी नूतन सरकार गठन करबा को तालिबान को आह्वान दे छि यूनाइटेड नेशन अफगानिस्तान रे उपजितबा स्थिति कुने सोमवार जातिसंघ सुरक्षा परिषद रा जरूरी बैठक अनुष्ठित होइ छि अफगानिस्तान आतंकी संगठन रा भूस्वर्ग होइ परिबो नाही अंतरराष्ट्रीय समुदाय एने एकजुट होंतु बोली जातिसंघ रा सेक्रेटरी जनरल अंटोनियो गुटेरेस ए बैठक रे कहिछन्ते तालिबान को युद्धर अंत करी अफगानिस्तान वासी को अधिकार अक्षुण रखबा को से परामर्श दैछन्ते विशेष करी अफगानिस्तान रा नागरिकन को सुरक्षा नै से चिंतित थिबा बेले वर्तमान परिस्थिति रे विश्ववासी अफगानिस्तान वासी को साथी छाडी देबा उचित नै बोली से उद्वेग प्रकाश करिछन्ते सेपरि भारत पक्षरो अफगानिस्तान रे चलैतबा उन्नयनमूलक कार्य रे तालिबान कोनोसी बाधा न उपजाउ बोली जातिसंघ सुरक्षा परिषद अध्यक्ष तथा भारतीय प्रतिनिधि टीएस तिरुमूर्ति गुरुत्वारोप करछिते अनेपटे अफगानिस्तान रे लागि रहितबा संकट को नै अमेरिका राष्ट्रपति जो बाइडेन अमेरिका को संबोधन करछिते से कहिछन्ते जे अफगानिस्तान रे कठिन समय रे अश्रव घनी देश छाडी चली जाउछिते बिना लढै रे काहें कि देश छाडुछिते बोली से प्रश्न करछिते I call for an immediate end to violence, for the rights of all Afghans to be respected, and for Afghanistan to comply with all international agreements to which it is a party. Mr. President, Afghans are a proud people with a rich cultural heritage. They have known generations of war and hardship. They deserve our full support. The following days will be pivotal. The world is watching. We cannot and must not abandon the people of Afghanistan. Kabul residents are living in absolute fear right now. Mr. President, there is no time for blame game anymore. We have an opportunity to prevent further violence, prevent Afghanistan descending into a civil war and becoming a pariah state. Therefore, the Security Council and the UN Secretary General should use every means at its disposal to call for an immediate cessation of violence and respect for human rights and international humanitarian law. The Taliban have said that they will accept an inclusive government, that they would wish to have a government which represents all uh, groups in Afghanistan. And 
they are agreeable to engage with the Taliban in order to uh, form a, a inclusive uh, authority. And we hope that our efforts and the efforts of other friends will be successful. The Olympics are a very important thing to do with the Olympics. The Olympics are a very important thing to do with the Olympics. आपण देखुछन जे ओडिसा सरकार नतर पुर व्यवस्था करा जाय छ ओलंपिक्स रे भाग नै भारतर मानक बढाइतबा भारत पय गर्व गौरवानितबा उभय भारतीय पुरुष ओ महिला हॉकी दल को आज ओडिसा रे संबर्धित करा जइबो ओ किछि समय परे मुख्यमंत्री नवीन पटनायक संबर्धित करिवे जहार चित्र सामना को आसु छि एवं जहा आशा करा जाउ छि जे उभय भारतीय पुरुष ओ महिला हॉकी दल को यहा द्वारा बेस उत्साह मध्ये मिलबो आगु को आगामी समय रे के भले बाबे आहुरी अधिक भलो प्रदर्शन करिवे विश्व स्तर रे हजि जाइतबा भारतीय हॉकी रो से स्थिति को पूर्व स्थिति को पुणी थरे फेरे आनिबे ए आशा प्रत्येक हॉकी प्रेमी प्रत्येक भारतीय अंकर रहि छि एवं ओडिसा माटी रु जेतु समान को स्पोंसर करा जाइतला जेतु आनुसंगिक सुविधा राज्य सरकार बारंबार जुगाई छेंति तेनु आज ओलंपिक्स रे अंश ग्रहण करितबा ए दुई हॉकी दल को ओडिसा आमंत्रण करा जाई छे से मान को संबर्धित करिवार कार्यक्रम मधे रहि छी जहार सीधा चित्र हम आपन पाखरे पहुचाउ छु द ऑनरेबल स्पोर्ट्स मिनिस्टर श्री तुषार कांति बहरा टू एड्रेस द ऑडियंस एंड शेयर अ फ्यू वर्ड्स विद अस सर द स्टेज इज योर्स ऑनरेबल चीफ मिनिस्टर श्री नवीन पटनायक सर प्रेसिडेंट इंडियन ओलंपिक एसोसिएशन डॉक्टर नरेंद्र ध्रुव बात्राजी चेयरमैन ओडिशा हॉकी प्रमोशन काउंसिल श्री दिलीप तिर्की जी प्रेसिडेंट हॉकी इंडिया श्री ज्ञानेंद्र निगम मोहन जी वुमेन्स टीम कैप्टन रानी रामपाल एंड मेंबर्स ऑफ द टीम मेंस टीम है कैप्टन मनप्रीत सिंह एंड मेंबर्स ऑफ द टीम डिग्नेटरीज ऑफिशियल्स ऑफ हॉकी इंडिया state government friends from the media and eminent sports persons gathered here greetings and a very good evening to all of you today india stands tall with pride because of the phenomenal performance of the indian national hockey teams at the tokyo olympics they have scripted history a new era for indian hockey has begun and this has been made possible due to the sheer hard work dedication and sacrifice of the teams and continuous efforts of hockey india to better the performance of the team odisha who has partnered with the hockey federation since several years is euphoric and today we are gathered here to acknowledge and felicitate our achievers this was made possible due to the vision of honorable chief minister odisha i extend my warm welcome to honorable chief minister sri navin patnaik ji Dr Narendra Dhruv Bataji has been the force behind the revival of the Indian hockey with his grit and determination he ensured that the hockey teams made history his contribution to the development of olympic sports and athletes is exemplary on behalf of i extend a warm welcome to him three times olympian son of the soil and chairman hockey promotion padma shri dilip tirki ji is an inspiration to many his dedication to better the hockey ecosystem is truly inspirational i welcome sri dilip tirki ji to this felicitation ceremony i welcome sri ganendra nigamam ji president hockey india to this august gathering hockey india is among the few professionally run federations in the country and the results are visible during the tokyo olympics and above all a hearty welcome to rani rampal Manpreet Singh and all the players of our national hockey teams you have surpassed all expectations and redefined the sport you brought back the glory to indian hockey you won hearts of a million indians with your stellar performance and i welcome you to odisha your second home and to this occasion dignitaries sports persons officials of hockey india and the state government members of media and the people watching this ceremony live a warm welcome to you all for joining us in this ceremony thank you namaskar a big thank you to shri behra ji for the warm welcome and now for the man at the helm of india's rise at the olympics a visionary par excellence 
President Indian Olympics Association, Sri Narendra Dhruv Batra, has been a commendable sports administrator and has played a pivotal role in progressing the development of Olympic sports within India. In recognition to his contribution towards sports, may I now request the Honorable Chief Minister to felicitate Dr. Batra, President IOA. Round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. May I now ask Dr. Batra to please share his thoughts with us as well, sir. Honorable Chief Minister of Odisha, Shri Naveen Patnaik Ji, Honorable Sports and Youth Services Minister, Shri Tushar Kanti Behara Ji, Shri Dali, Dr. Dilip Turki, Padma Shri, Arjuna Wadi and Chairman, Odisha Hockey Promotion Council, President Hockey India, Manpreet Singh, Captain Indian Men Hockey Team, Rani Rampal, Captain Indian Women's Hockey Team, Distinguished Guests, Good Evening to Everyone. It's a very proud moment for Indian hockey that both men and women teams created history at the Tokyo Olympics. This success holds a special place in the hearts of the people of Odisha and the Honorable Chief Minister Shri Naveen Patnaik Ji, who has been at the forefront in supporting hockey in the last few years. <laughs> Odisha is now the home of Indian hockey courtesy the vision of Shri Naveen Patnaik ji, who stepped up and made con crucial contributions to the sport by not only sponsoring the teams, but also providing the infrastructure and platform to become capable of winning medals at Olympics. The iconic Kalinga Stadium, which has hosted major tournaments like the Men's Hockey World Cup, FIH Men's Series Finals, Olympic Qualifiers in 2019, and FIH Pro League in 2020, gave the Indian team a great exposure before the stern test of them for the Tokyo Olympics. We now look forward to the 2023 World Cup hosted in Bhuvneshwar and Rorkila, which will be constructed as the country's biggest stadium and being the president of FIH, I can proudly say this will be one of the best stadiums or the best stadium in the world. <laughs> Apart from hockey, the Odisha state government has been actively supporting other sports disciplines as well. We are extremely thankful for this support and these are the steps required for India to become a global powerhouse in sports. I would like to take this opportunity to thank Honorable Chief Minister Shri Naveen Patnaik ji and the people of Odisha for showing their love and affection for the sport of hockey and helping our teams achieve the Olympic dream for India. With your continued support, Indian hockey will look to build up on the achievements from Tokyo Olympics and continue this steady rise to take Indian hockey back to the elite level where it actually belongs. It's always a pleasure to be in the sports capital of India, which is Bhuvneshwar. So before I conclude, with your permission, I'd just like to say a few words from my heart. Because this speech is prepared but I want to say something I've been, I've been a hockey player, I don't know how many of you know, I've been in three India camps also way back in late 79s, 80, couldn't make it to the India team. The facilities which are being given by Government of India, Sports Authority of India were being given in 1980, 90, 2000, 2010, 2015, there's been no change in that. What actually changed, now we have reached this level. In addition to what they give us, we got support from government of Odisha, which helped us. We had about 59 domestic tournaments, which are revived now. Almost all the tournaments are revived. The national championships were not happening. I would say since 2010, except 2020, when there was COVID, we couldn't do it because of the pandemic. The national championships are held every year. They are in senior, junior, and sub-junior. This is what makes the difference how hockey came up. Each tournament costs about two and a half crores. 
plus we started academies tournaments, plus we started institutional teams tournaments also. This contributes to about 18, 19 crores and where did the support come from to build this infrastructure so that the pyramid could be started for getting the athletes from 12 to 15 years of age. We are now prepared for 24 and 28 Olympics. That's the status right now. From Government of India, the money we get contributes only 70 to 80 percent, 20 to 25 percent. Hockey India has to put for all foreign tours, domestic, everywhere. This is where Odisha stepped in and made all the difference. And this is what you see. We have an elite team sitting here, but I can tell you we have 100 more athletes sitting to jump into their places. That's the kind of backup we have. And this is only because the support we received from Odisha. I was at PM's function yesterday, and a comment was made when uh, he visited the men's table that it's not that we don't recognize other medals, that until you win a medal in hockey, it feels we haven't won a medal. And that is what, after 41 years, these boys achieved. Again, I would say, with support from Odisha, because that is what made the change from 2015, because I am in hockey from 20, uh, nine, 2009 onwards. So, yes, are a difference, eh? and this made, difference was made due to the vision of our Honorable Chief Minister when everyone was running after cricket, where there is glamour, there is uh, everyone behind it, there is a lot of publicity. No one thought of other sports besides cricket. And that's where Odisha stepped in, the people of Odisha stepped in and you supported us in 2017. And you can see the results now. I can assure you on behalf of hockey that the support and love and affection we've got from you, from our people of Odisha, Honorable Chief Minister, that the graph of hockey will not go down now. We have reached a stage where now a minimum level has been set and the graph will be same or it goes up. And I, I hope to see it going up. From the bottom of my heart, I would say, I would like to give credit of this medal. Everybody gets the credit, the athletes, everyone. But in my personal opinion, Odisha has a very major role in this medal, which has come back to the country after 14 years. And I want to thank Honorable Chief Minister for his vision, for his support, which led to this, for achieving this position by us. And one more thing just before concluding, I would add. Yesterday, I was with the athletics team. And they were asking me, I said, what are the, what more do you need? They spoke about indoor stadium. That adds to their points and they can get into qualification for world championships and other events. Surprisingly, when I was speaking with uh, Secretary of Sports today, uh, there is a stadium coming up in Odisha next year, which is an indoor stadium. Something we didn't even ask. That is the vision of Odisha. Something we didn't even ask. I was planning to meet Government of India Secretary of Sports and ask him that we want this for future, but that's already happening in Odisha. So that's the vision, that's the thing. That's why we call it sports capital. And that's why we call that this is the place I feel as my second home now. And always would love to come here. And now I would like to thank everyone for supporting us. Thank you, Honorable Chief Minister. Thank you all for supporting us. Thank you very much. And a very big thank you to you, sir, as well, for helping India achieve her dreams. I request Sri Naveen Patnaikji to kindly accept the two mementos from Dr. Batra, President IOA, and President FIH. Thank you, sir. indeed. Lots to celebrate tonight. Thank you, sirs. I now call upon the gentleman who has immensely contributed to the game by ensuring the top-notch health and fitness levels of our Olympians. He is the first Indian doctor to be appointed as FIH Medical Officer for the Olympic Games. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Colonel Dr. Bibhu Kalyan Nayak, Chair, FIH Health and Safety Committee. He would be receiving a check of 5 lakh rupees for his invaluable contribution to Indian hockey. I request Sri Patnaik sir to do the honours.
thank you to the Honorable Chief Minister and Dr. Nayak. Moving on, this incredible feat would not have been possible had it not been for Hockey India. Over the last decade, Hockey India has played a pivotal role in building a strong representation for India in both men's and women's teams. I request the Honorable Chief Minister to felicitate Hockey India and request President Hockey India, Mr. Gyanendra Nigambam, to accept the check and filigree on behalf of his entire team. Thank you all for your precious efforts towards helping our teams flourish in this sport. The organization has been awarded a check of 50 lakhs for their efforts. Huge round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. And now the moment has arrived wherein we recognize the meritorious performance of our hockey heroes and express our pride and gratitude towards their unmatched efforts to make India proud. Each winner will be awarded a check of 5 lakh rupees each. And we begin with the women's hockey team. Here goes the first award. This award is for the player with the maximum number of goals saved. As they say, a goal saved is a goal earned. And the winner of this award is our Arjuna awardee and the very iconic goalkeeper, Savita. Round of applause for her, ladies and gentlemen. While she comes up on stage, let's first take a quick look at the heroics of our wall who has defended the pride of the country on our screen. कहीं ना कहीं बहुत बड़ा रोल जो यानी कि स्पोकमैन है उसका भी रहा क्योंकि प्रेशर को हैंडल कैसे करते हैं वो चीज पे हमने काफी माइंडफुल सेशन किए ब्रीथिंग क्लासेस की जो भी ट्रेनिंग सेशन होता था उसमें मेन यही रहता था कि पेनल्टी कोर्नर अटैक डिफेंस और शूट आउट पे हम काफी काम करते थे प्रेजेंट मोमेंट में रहना है जो है कि नॉर्मल पेनल्टी कॉर्नर की तरह है बॉल आ रही है रोकना है Fantabulous performance, Savita. There she is on stage, please. I uh, request the Honorable Chief Minister to hand over the check to Savita. Round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to be generous with those claps tonight. They're truly well earned by Olympians. Very well done, Savita. And now the next award for the player for the maximum number of goal assists. And this award is jointly rewarded to the captain of our women's hockey team, Rani, and our forward player, Navneet Kaur. Let's take a look first at their superb performances at the Olympics. Here on your screen. As a team, when we play, we perform good performances. मुझे पूरी उम्मीद है अपनी टीम से कि ये जो परफॉर्मेंस है हमें कॉन्फिडेंस देगी नेक्स्ट ईयर की टूर गोल असिस्ट करवाना बहुत ही जरूरी है गेम में हर कोई सोचता है कि मैं स्कोर करूं पर अगर हम टीम के फायदे के बारे में सोचते हैं तो ये हर प्लेयर की रिस्पांसिबिलिटी बनती है कि वो गोल असिस्ट करवाए I request Rani and Amneets to please come forward to collect your award. And of course, I request the Honorable Chief Minister to hand over the check to Rani and Navneet. Congratulations. Very well done. And the awards will continue. And now for our third award for the evening, the player with the maximum. Siddharth Chitra, upon the gutle, Odisha Lok Sabha Bhavan Roo, Jyoti Mukhyamantri Nabin Patnaik, Bharatya Ubhay Purusha Mahila Hockey Team ra shadhesyon ko 
संबर्धित करलंपिक्स चमत्कार प्रदर्शन समय सर बुलेटिन को ये रखुँ मत विदाय दिंतु नमस्कार